The hottest month of the year may be behind us, but wildfires continue to ravage the Pacific Northwest. The destruction left behind by a raging wildfire in north central Washington state. The damage is shocking and difficult to track. The U.S. Forest Service counted 31 distinct fires on Saturday. But as residents of the region are learning, it only takes one fire to destroy a home. Lost everything. It feels unreal. It feels like it's not happening. A fire near Pateros, Washington recently burned 300 homes, the most in that state's history. But it's another fire that's been dominating the headlines, the Rowena Fire named for a small Oregon town nearby. An Oregon official on Friday called it the nation's top firefighting priority as it forced hundreds of families from their homes. We saw the panic and felt the fear as firefighters and deputies ordered residents to get out. But after evacuations, close to a thousand firefighters went to work. And on Saturday night, they had an announcement. The fire was contained and almost 740 homes had been saved. Farther south, a California fire in Mendocino is making headlines for a different reason. Eight firefighters have been burned tonight battling the Lodge fire. Some of them are suffering from serious injuries. An official tried to explain. Basically, it was the end result of some very extreme fire behavior that was unexpected. The firefighters were treated and released from the hospital, but the Lodge fire remains uncontained and has so far torched 7,100 acres. For Newsy, I'm Sebastian Martinez.